Hello, my name is Hector. Welcome back to Sky Adventures. Last episode, we finished off the magic tech tree thing. I don't think it's just called the magic tree. There you go. Look at all of that. We finished off by finishing with some Batania. We did all of the Thorncraft stuff. I can't believe it. And now... We basically only got one category left, and that is bees. You can see I've done all the stuff so far that has anything that had an EMC value. So now we need to do the thing. We need to do the thing to make to make all of this happen. Uh, I know a little bit of forestry, and uh, an even smaller bit, I think, of genderstry, which is based on forestry, it's sort of to make forestry easier. Now, I've already had a little sneak peek and immediately we need a carpenter and I need seed oil, which you get from a squeezer, which is EM seed, and basically putting seeds in that. So that's what we're going to start off with by doing. So carpenter, bam, um, a squeezer, a bam. So we've got those. Uh, I need flux thingy-majigs, flux plugs, uh, points, I can't remember which, adding, so yeah, there we go, doing a bit of that, let's come over here, we'll, we'll set these up around here for now, I think, uh, how many singularities have I got, wow, six, <laughs> we don't need any of those, but that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, so let's add that and that, there we go, bam, and you, come on, there we go, so these need, these basically need a missing resources. Ah, we should maybe actually put that on that side. Never mind. Oh, we'll, we'll make do. We'll make do. We need seeds. So let us do a bit of this. There you go. Huh, there we go. And that will get us seed oil. And you can see you get a remarkably little amount from all of this. So let us just get a hopper quickly. There we go. And I'm hoping that this works. I don't know. I don't, I, I'm hoping it will. Yes, it will. There we go. We can just do that and make sure we get enough seed oil. So, and the next thing we need is wood. Let's get some wood. Uh, we. I think we can basic. Oh, fireproof. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not fireproof stuff. Um, there's so much, so much, so much wood. Uh, I should have probably put oak in. There you go. Uh, oak. Your standard oak, there we go. And what was it? We needed just just that basically. Just that. Okay, in the carpenter. So we do that. And this is where you put the resources to make the thing. And then we need to put in some um some of that. So we need a fluid conduit, maybe. Yeah, let's do that. There we go. And this should basically give us at least this. So let's extract you. There we go, insert you, is that already doing it? That's totally doing it. No recipe, oh, it is, it's totally doing it. Is it? Yeah, it is doing it, it is doing it, there we go. It's got enough seed oil, so we can make a few of these, and it, you probably will want a few of these, because, um, there we go, and it should make, it should make more now. As soon as it gets enough seed oil, it should make another one, because I think, if we look at the users, it, it's used in quite a lot of different types of things. I imagine we probably need a few of these. So, first of all, apiary. Um, I really, have I not got any slabs? Ugh, of course I don't. Why would I? Why would I have any slabs available? Look at all the random wood that I do have. Uh, and in none of this, there we go. In none of this, I have slabs. There we go, right, apiary, boom. Right, excellent, that is one off the list. Uh, apiary there, bam, okay. Uh, a bee house, which I'm guessing is somewhat similar. And don't worry, we won't be doing all of these on uh, on camera, but I just thought we'd do a few of the, ah, now. So we need a, any kind of comb. So I do actually need to start like looking into how to get some bees again. I'm guessing the industrial apiary is probably one of the better ways. Do I actually have any bees? Let's have a look. Ooh, I don't. Do I not? Nothing? No bees at all? Wow. Normally when you mine stuff, you end up with like 
some bees somewhere. Oh, we've got some sturdy casing. That's very nice. So we do have a little bit, but yeah, I need to get me some, uh, <laughs> I need to get some actual bees in the house. There we go. Look at that. No queen. So how do we get a bee? Uh, isn't there a, a bee like a tractor or something it's called? Uh, I, I need to look this up. So I'm making myself the Scooperator MX200 Turbo uh, from a scoop and a power module. There we go. And uh, that should immediately do. And basically all of the hives, if we have a look, uh, are in here. Look at that. So, well, I say all. Uh, a fair number. A fair number of hives. And basically, from what I remember, this basically should allow us to do that and get... get everything that we need now you will get attacked by the bees for breaking the hive but you can see we're getting we're getting some drones we've got some princesses so we can start doing some stuff so honeycomb uh, that will allow us or it should allow us let's have a look see uh forestry and what was it a bee house that we needed Yes, there we go. So we should now, there we go, we can use that honeycomb to get the next type of thing. So basically, I'm going to go ahead and, and try and do like Apius chest. We should be able to do alviary, maybe? I don't know. Let's have a, a quick look-see. Alviary, uh, let's have a look. That is more study. And centered paneling, which is, oh, <laughs> uh, we are nowhere near that. So a royal jelly, we need be produce and you can see we need like an we need one of these guys imperial or classic and then basically this this is now gonna make us down go down into all of this and breed uh okay so i did a little bit of this in all the mods three uh, i definitely got to uh to royal jelly so i vaguely know how to do that uh beeswax let's have a look centrifuge so it looks like you get beeswax from putting pretty much any comb into the, the centrifuge. Okay, we can do that. That is doable. So yeah, we're, we're definitely a little bit away from that. What about all the other things? I wish we could access this in a different menu. Soulful wax, uh, impregnated frame, database. Okay, so... I'm going to have to have a little bit more of a look-see at all of this. Honeycomb block. Surely that that should be able... We should be able to make that from that. Surely. Surely, surely. Uh, yes, look at that. Honeycomb. Okay, so... Apiris, yes, there you go. So, this is doable. So, I'm going to make a few of these. And then, we'll look to tackling how, uh, how to do some bee breeding. I've got a water hive and a tropical hive here. There we go. We can get all of that stuff. And that should allow us to get some silk comb and... Oh, we've, have we not got any watery comb? Oh, that is annoying. Uh, let's try that again then. Water hive. Let's do a few. I just want the water comb because, basically, uh, you can see I've got, I've got beeswax now uh, out of that. Uh, and if we put that in, hopefully that should do that. And we should get... Was it the silky comb? So we should get the silky propolis out of this, hopefully, at some stage, I believe. Um, yeah, look, 80% chance of getting that. So there we go. That is that. Uh, so if we have a look here. So I, I did the honeycomb block. I did beeswax. There we go. We've got that now. Excellent stuff. I, I should be able to get the water one fairly easily doing the same way. And then all of the rest starts to become a lot more complicated. So I think for the rest, we're going to try and get the royal jelly. That is going to that's going to help us out, I think, uh, getting that because it unlocks quite a few of the other recipes. So, yeah, I'm going to be busy as a veritable, well, you get it. There we go. Watery propolis. Man, that was a little bit harder. So I had to put a water queen in here to get the comb. And then you saw it. We just made it into the watery thingy. There we go. Bam. Bam. Oh, $50 for that. That was, uh, wow. That was quite quite expensive there we go so i now come to the harder part where we have to do some more of this like draconic chunk with a skeleton skull i can only imagine that those are going to be hard now these are weird because the saplings it does look that like they are emc'd but 
I th I'm sure if I've put like these in that I haven't got them. So zeb so zebra wood, for instance, let's have a look. If I put zebra in, uh, oh, oh, it does. But ah, but no sapling. <laughs> what? So I get that, but I don't get this. That's weird. What happens if, out of interest, out of interest, we do this? Do we get, do these drop saplings? I have no idea. I have no idea. It doesn't look like it, does it? Uh, so I, <laughs> I don't know how to get any of this. Uh, so zebra wood. Let's have a, a quick look at this together. Uh, and see zebra wood sapling <sighs> tree breeding of course we do of course we have to do tree breeding uh so the myrtle ebony which is dark oak and kapok a kapok is jungle and teak what's teak dark oak and jungle okay and there's only 10 percent wow wow okay how do i even do tree breeding what what do i do this in <laughs> i don't know what is this what is this magical thing? Uh, is this is this forestry? Yes, it is. Right, let's have a gander. Uh, forestry tree uh, tree. Aha, the arboretum managed and manual. Tre uh, but that's a tree farm. Ha. Huh. Flexible. Ooh, wow. Thermionic fabricator. Okay, which is yeah, that is EMC'd. Uh, so some eh, that's that's fairly doable. Okay. Oh ah, liquid glass. Now then, uh, which is just is it, is it just glass? How do we make the glass? Is it literally just we have to smelt it? Really? That is quite annoying. That <laughs> it's really annoying. Uh, okay. So. That might be the way to do tree breeding then. That's great. That's another another thing to add to the list. Right then, what we have here is a mutagen producer and the advanced mutatron. And both of these are EMC'd, so that's no problem. We make mutagen by just putting stuff in basically and like that, that does its thing. Then this is in here. And then you need some labware, which again, you can see it is EMCable. And this is, I believe, if I remember correctly, how we, oh, hang on, we need drones, don't we? That's the thing. Uh, it's been a while since I've done this forest. Um, it's a drone, I think, I believe. Yeah, there we go. So that does a common, there we go. And this is basically how we start doing the stuff. Uh, this is how we start getting to that royal jelly. So if we look here, we basically, I need, I think an imperial is the easiest and it's got a 20% 20, 20 chance and 15 for royal jelly. So even getting that is, you know, and I know this one has, classical has more, but you need to do like subspecies of bees or something like that. So I'm focusing on the noble. I now need a cultivator drone and that we get from a common and a forest uh, thing. So can we put that in there? Ah, no, I need a princess. I need a princess. So what we didn't then do, we put this in here. Uh, I don't know what flowers this needs, a common. I do wish that I didn't need to sort out the flowers as much. And I think you can put almost any drones in. So and let's get some, uh, what have we got a lot of? We've got a lot of those. There we go to do that. But I, I need to find out what the common queen um, basically gets as, oh, maybe we can find out in the, the analyzer. Uh, so put that there. Does it say flower type? Flowers, it says flowers. Okay, so that's that's useful. So let us get let us get uh, a poppy like that. Bam, 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 and do that. And at some point, I'm hoping that this takes a while to sometimes update. When I did that for the water bee or whatever it was called, I needed a lily pad, and it took a while for it to sort of catch on that, you know, the flower might be there. And uh, the watch of time does nothing on the industrial apiary to make this faster. Uh, so yeah, we're sort of stuck with that basically. I don't think I need that one. Uh, and what I could do maybe is do the production upgrade. Production, uh, no, is that not it? 
sure it was called that. Let's have a look. Upgrade. Uh, where are you? No. I sort of vaguely know what it looks like. No. Oh, come on. Really? Upgrade. Uh, and let's put forestry. Oh, is it not? Is it not forestry? Surely it is. Where are you? Where's all the upgrades? Oh no, this is gender street. <laughs> uh, gen. Oh man, come on, Hector. Up. There we go. There it is. Uh, ah, and it is called that, but it is not EMC'd. So, ah, oh, you need royal jelly. There you go. So we've just gone in a nice little thing. Has this done its thing yet? No, still not. Great. So, uh, I'm getting a cultivated... I've got... Well, I've got a cultivated queen. I'm getting a princess and some drones now. I've got a common princess and some common drones here as well. So, if you want to sort of figure out how to do this, first, don't put the automation upgrade in because that basically just cycles through. There we go. We've got a princess and some drones now because basically with a queen... There, so, there you go. A queen... You cannot, you cannot uh, breed with queens. You need uh, princesses and drones in order to do that. And the way to get these is you get a queen and you put it in one of these and you breed it with just some drones, basically. I don't even think you need drones, but uh, I think you will get some drones of the queen type, basically. And what the automation upgrade would do normally is it would keep putting the princess in and breed them with the drones, and it will cycle it through, basically. Um, but that's not what we want. We want the drones and a princess, so that we're doing it like this. That is how you do that. Then you come over to this, and I think let's get that out. Oh, I've got another common princess. Excellent. And I think... I can't remember which way around it is. Um, aha! So there you go. We got we got a few options here with uh, with the genetics labware. So you can choose that. I'm obviously going to choose that. Uh, that's the one that I want. And there we go. We get a noble queen. Now we are we are getting on our way to to doing this. So we need a noble princess first off um, in order to breed with a majestic drone. How do we get majestic stuff? Well, ha, let's have a look. We need a noble princess and a cultivated queen. So there you go. This is sort of how you end up having to do it. So there's a lot, a lot of, you know, um, breeding and uh, then breeding again. So it's, it's good to make, like, everything at least twice, pretty much. So that's what I'm sort of doing with all of this, trying to make everything at least twice. And you can obviously have uh, multiple apiaries doing all of this. Now, I have put the Watch of Time on. And I think it's making it maybe a little bit faster. I don't know. Uh, but that's how that's how to do all of this. So at some point we should get an Imperial Queen, which we then can put in this to get uh, this stuff and then put in the centrifuge to get the Royal Jelly. That's how it's going to roll, how it's going to play out. Look at that. We've got some Royal Jelly. Finally, we've got some Dripping Comb as well. So that's still the Imperial Queen. I just bred up uh, from, I think, a majestic drone and a noble princess. That, that took quite a while. That took quite a while to get all of those, like, bred up and do it. <laughs> Look at the amount of bees that are swarming around right now. And you can see they, when they're in the apiary, they do have a chance to, like, get more flowers around here. So let's quickly, and uh, let's do that. Royal jelly, done. Few, so I think I'm gonna have a quick look at what we can um, do with the royal jelly because there are certain things that we can make. Ah, like the database. Ah ha uh, Is that all? And the production upgrade. So the database is. It looks like the only other thing that we desperately need. What's the arborist chest? I'm guessing we can make that. Let's uh, let's try and do this quickly. Um, let's do that again. Nope, that's not the wrong. There we go. There it is. Right. That. You. Oh, dear. So the game kicked me then when I tried to, like, shift-click the arborist chest in into the grid, which is a little bit odd. But there you go. We've got that now. Okay. Um, so I need probably one of these. There we go. And can I just make one of those now? What am I missing? What's the thing at the top? 
Oh, the the portable analyzer, which I do have. Bam, there we go. That's another that's another thing crossed off. Where are we? Bees. Database has gone as well. Boom. Okay, so I think next episode we'll probably look into some tree breeding. And I'm guessing, I'm guessing we'll need to, you know, get stuck into this. Hopefully, hopefully we can finish this next episode. That will be grand. And then all we've got left is buying everything, basically. So we might, we might just have ourselves a very, you know, jam-packed episode next, next time. I hope. I hope. We're so close. We're so close to actually finishing Sky Adventures. I'm excited. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. Maybe you sort of learned how to do bees a little bit. It's not that complicated really uh, for this kind of stuff, but uh, if you want to get into it properly, it's a lot more complicated. But um, for, for us, for now, for this, it's fine. So thank you for watching. If you did enjoy it, like, comment, subscribe. If you fancy it, that would be lovely. As for me, I've been Hector, this has been Sky Adventures, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Or BB. -bye.